I'm the ag teacher at Bellevue High School, so that means that there's animals and a garden that we have to take care of. Currently here at the school we have a pig, a horse, and we have about 14 head of cattle including calves. And so every day they still have to be fed whether the kids are here or not. So I'm the one that's out here most of the time and the animals have gotten kind of used to just seeing me I think now as well. It's kind of I think difficult on them too because they're used to having all the kids here with them. Um, but we're getting it done every day taking care of them. I came out here one day and I think it was a Saturday and there was a new calf and we're trying to think of a name. I kind of thought about Corona or Rona, something like that since she was actually during, during the, the very first part of the shutdown. I understand the reason that I'm still here is because agriculture in general can't shut down. It's not like we can just go back in two months and pick everything back up. Whether it's animals or crops, they have to be taken care of and there are certain seasons for things. There are certain times when those livestock animals are ready and have to go to market. So everywhere in agriculture right now, the farmers, the ranchers, they're still out there working. They haven't gotten any time off. Um, those little memes you see sitting at home in their pajamas, they're not doing that. So I think we really got to give a shout out to all the farmers and ranchers out there.